hey guys welcome back i do change shirts in case you like bounce from uh channel to channel you know both of my channels i do change shirts quite often um uh it's just i happen to be wearing this germany shirt a lot lately um i probably will be keeping this channel open um what happened is with the other channel someone um and this is what i hate about making secondary channels somebody got involved with me from facebook and um unfortunately if you're on facebook you remember why i told you i didn't like facebook because you get two types of people on there and this person like came up to me with a problem and unfortunately all this person ever wanted to talk about was their problem and eventually it was starting to like leak into my brain space and um this person was a very very jealous very disturbed individual and disturbed is the only way to put it because um they were very hysterically angry and very possessive over the subject they were they were interested in and they were like um my mama always used to say um if somebody is acting towards other people in a certain way she said that's okay she said but know that they're doing it to you behind your back she said, just so you know that. And I figured, well, she's doing it to me behind my back. Well, you know, it's a woman. <laughs> it, it's like, it's always women causing me my problems on Facebook. Uh, it, usually on here is guys I have to kick out. On Facebook, it's women I have to kick out. Go figure. It's like, women like to cause drama on Facebook. Guys like to cause drama on YouTube. I don't know. Anyhow, she was just getting so toxic and so... uh angry and so jealous and so petty that i finally made a couple videos on the other channel like hey um you claim to be interested in the subject and everything but you're going about it all wrong that is not what you do and i sincerely tried to help this person i was like hey um you can't be going around being hateful and you can't be going around being mean and being petty and being jealous and hating on everyone you can't be doing this um you can't help some people and unfortunately that was like spilling into my own life and poisoning my own mind because when you are depressed you can't be playing clinical psychologist to other people you can't be doing that and she was just coming and basically crapping on my lawn and um i said you know this is all you ever want to talk about i said i'm having problems and it was true anytime i was posting about my problems she didn't have time for my problems but her problems were you know all the drama you know her problems were all the drama everybody got to drop everything and go take care of her the poor little princess is her oh, wow <laughs> don't make me mad <laughs> you think the german gets mad the polish and the italian get worse anyhow um i blocked that person on youtube so i won't be hearing from them on youtube and they vaped on um facebook so they're not on facebook anymore if they come back on facebook i'll just block them on facebook because i'm like you know what i i stated on facebook and maybe if you follow me on facebook you might not like my language but i was like you know what i have had enough of it i've had enough i've had enough of the pity behavior i've had enough of the cattiness uh if you're as interested in the subject as you say you are um you know you're not behaving with the decorum and it was just it was just so seeping into my mind and getting into everything that i just i gave up on everything <sighs> don't let people like get into your life seriously don't um because sometimes you have the best intentions and you want to help but they're just they're petty and they're um they're they'll just they want everything they want everything their way and they think if they scream and they shout and they yell they're going to get their way and that's you know that's the way of a little child that's like how a three-year-old or five-year-old or the president acts <laughs> basically like we have a three-year-old in the white house <laughs> and then they think they're going to get their way that's that's not how you get your way adults know that so i am okay i got rid of this person i got their crap out of my life they can go take their crazy crap somewhere else and they'll be telling someone else how evil i am and how i wouldn't help them and it's like no i try to help you but you're being a psycho bitch excuse my language uh i can't help you if you're going to be crazy and hateful and blame all the drama in your life on other people uh there's no the, i think I, the reason loki is running away and avoiding you is because you'd be crazy um yeah if even loki won't work with you 
there's nothing I can do for you. Um, and I don't like to call people out and discuss people's personal things, guys. But it's like, um, I try to tell this person very nicely. And that's what actually got me down and like pushed me to the breaking point. If people don't want to be with you, whether they're divine or they're human, you can't force them to be with you. And it's like, there are just some people you can't reason with. So I've blocked this person. Don't worry, I've blocked this person. They're blocked. They're not coming back. Uh, any of their little friends that show up, I will block them too. Um, they're just... Some people think that if they bully enough people and they scream enough and they yell enough, they'll get their way in the world. And that's not what's going to happen. I don't know why they think that happens, but that's not what's going to happen. Uh, what will actually uh, end up happening is they'll find out the uh, old gods are real and they're going to find out they're going to be very sorry. I usually don't talk religious on this channel. It's just I want to explain to you what happened and why I got so upset and um, why I was closing the channel because that just it leaked over into the rest of my life and this person was just being crazy and you know manipulative and um bug house and like make er everything had to become about her it's like I realized it because I took it didn't take a lot of psychology but I took enough and everything had to become about her it was like all about her all about her all about her everything had to be about her blah 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 I'd like to drive a tank over her slowly you know that song about dying of fire <laughs> you know when I take a hate in somebody it is it, fast and it lasts forever yeah okay guys um I will be fine um I don't know what to play. I, I'm not going to play Roblox. I really don't like it. Um, I, I don't. I don't like Roblox. I don't like Minecraft. I don't like a lot of those. A lot of the games that are out now. They're just. And a lot of the games are coming out on. Um, um what do we even call it? Game Jolt. Um, they're kind of crappy right now. I'm sorry. They are. They're getting low ratings for a reason. They're kind of crappy right now. Um, but when I find good games, I will play good games, but I'm not going to just play games to, you know, play games. I will play games when I find worthy games. I'll put up content. Um, some of the stuff I have thought of doing, um, you can't always do. Um, I thought of doing silly stuff like filming stuff at a playground and, well, you know, that sounds kind of sketchy. It's like, I was like, they're like this coolest slide and I wanted to take like the, um, those door heads, those like uh, plushy ones I had, I wanted to take one and like throw it up to like top of the slide and let it keep coming down to the camera and throw it up and like keep coming down to the camera. But unfortunately, the slide is like right across from the skull. I'm like, I could see this scenario unfolding already and I don't like where it's going. So I'm not going to film that one. Like maybe in summer when like school so I can film that one. But I'm like right for right now I can see where that scenario is going. And that's not good because you know the weirdo with the backpack and the camera playing with a toy on a slide. You have a YouTube channel huh? I'm sure you do. Yeah, that that's that's not going to sound good to anybody. So, um, yeah, uh, you do have to be careful when you're an adult what you film. People people around here got to be in everybody's business. If you're on like a playground or like, it's really not a playground. It's like in a community park and it's just like like a swing set. But still, people will be looking at you like, what you doing? And you tell me you have a YouTube channel. And we're like, uh huh, what you doing? Uh huh. You know what I mean. People love being your business. Okay, guys. So I will see you later. But I usually won't be bringing stuff from the other channel over. Unless, like, it would really affect stuff. But I will tell you guys when stuff really seriously affects the main channel. Because I really didn't realize I let that person get to me as much as I did. I thought I had really handled it. And I thought I knew what was going on. I really didn't realize I got as affected as I did. And then I realized I really did because um, I realized she was going behind my back. I knew she was going behind my back and doing it to me because I can guarantee you when someone is talking smack about you, uh, other people to you and keeps asking you and asking you and asking you and asking you like a two-year-old uh, repeatedly if this happened or that happened or this happened or that happened with these other people. Um... 
like, how should I know, man? Like, I wasn't there. Um, then they're doing it to, with other people about you. And it's like, I was just so stressed out, and I wanted this person out of my life. And Loki even wanted this person out of my life. And I, I should have just got rid of them, like, from the first inkling of, I don't like this person. But I always give people the benefit of the doubt way too much. And that's what happened. So, <laughs> I paid for it. Um, but, you know, you can't be paranoid and not talk to anybody, but sometimes it will bite you in the six when you're kind to people that don't deserve it, too. But what are you going to do? Um, so I'll see you guys later, and um, I'm going to be okay. The bad person went away, and if the bad person comes back, I have firearms training. <laughs> Good to know, right? <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.